Let's get it. Let's go. Yo, yo, yo. It's your boy Gabe. We're back again with another video. <laughs> what is going on, everyone? It's your boy Gabe. We're back again with another video. And this is probably going to be one of my favorite videos because this is my dream truck. Literally, I literally dream about this truck. What you're looking at is a 2001 Ram TRX. This car is a literal beast. Like, look at it. A literal beast. So I'll be showing you guys the exterior of the TRX, and then I'll be showing you guys everything you need to know about the exterior that I know. And then I'll be showing you guys how to get in, I'll show you guys the interior, show you guys the hood, and then I'll show you guys the engine. I'll show you what this thing could do. This car took a lot of shots at the Raptor. And I'm personally, I'm a Dodge guy. I know I got family out there that, that loves the Mustang, but I'm a Dodge guy. So uh, I don't, I'm really excited about this truck. The minute this truck dropped, it became my favorite truck. But anyways, we'll get into that. Make sure you guys follow me on Instagram. That's one underscore more 97. And make sure you guys subscribe and hit that ring button. All right, so you can stay tuned for the videos. Other than that, let's get to it. So we are first going to start with the front of this beast. I mean, look at it. Just look at it. Oh my, it literally looks like a damn dinosaur. It really does. Look at it. All right. That's a 6.2 liter supercharged. This is the Hellcat motor, by the way. This is the motor that is in the Hellcats. I'm, I love the grill. All right. We, we don't even... This grill looks so mean. Man, if this car's behind me, I'm moving out of the way, honestly. I really love the grill. I really like the headlights. It's got the daytime running lights here. And then we also got some headlights right here. All right, and, and these are real, by the way. All right, this grill right here, it actually sends air to the motor so it can get all the airflow that I can get. All right. All this goes into the engine so this car can get some airflow. And here too, I don't know if you guys can see it. There's a nice little opening right there where you guys, there it is right there. Boom. Direct air. Try to make this thing as dynamic with the air as possible. But let's carry on to the side of the car. It's very chunky. About the exterior, it's probably one of my favorite things about the exterior. It's very beefy. Um, if you guys see a, a Ram out there and it's not beefy, it is not a TRX. Okay, every single Ram TRX that you see out there is going to be beefy, just like this. See how this just comes out. Look at the bed, it just literally comes out. Oh my God, and this car came with the Ram bar from factory. Let me back up a little bit so you guys can see. Literally amazing, oh my God. And then we got a lot of branding, all right? We got Ram here, there's Ram here. We even got Ram here. There's a lot of branding. They're letting you know that this is a Ram model, okay? You see this thing coming, it's a Ram. We even got Ram in the front. But let's carry on to the back of the car. Look at the exhaust. I don't know how big these exhausts are, but they're pretty big. Sign right here. Another, again, Ram. I'm gonna be honest, I love the fact that the bed isn't extremely long, like some of those other trucks. All right, look at this. Oh, look at the suspension. I don't even know what all that could do. All right, but you won't find this in your average truck because again, this is not your average truck. <laughs> this is a TRX. Look at that. This is a TRX. All right, so now I'll show you guys how to access the bed. You're simply just gonna make sure the car is unlocked and go like that. And we're gonna pop this thing up. There's a button. You're just gonna press it. This is gonna come up, and then the bed slides. As simple as that. Boom, the bed's open. To reverse it, you just grab it, pull it all the way up. I'm gonna slap this all the way down. Boom. And that's how you access the bed. So now, let's access the car. So this is the key. So letting you know it's a TRX, I like this. The unlock, the lock, this is for the bed. 
drops the bed, it's the honk, press this twice, the car starts on. Let me go ahead and start the car for you guys. This truck means business, I'm gonna be honest. This truck means business. Now I'm gonna start it from the inside so you guys can see what it does when you're on the inside, all right? So you got your key, obviously. Nice little cubby for your key right here. But on the brake, you're gonna press the, push the start right here. That's pretty sick. Well, this is the interior of the TRX. This it is my favorite thing about this specific TRX because as you can see, where's the panoramic roof? Well, my good friend Gary had this customized and, it, and as you can see, it's like you're sitting in a Royce. Look at that, it's like you're in the Phantom. I actually do like that, that is pretty dope. But in this specific one, this is my favorite. This is my favorite thing about this car, I'm gonna be honest, about the interior actually. It has Apple CarPlay, you just gotta hook your phone up to it. There's a whole bunch of things you can do with this. But honestly, let's get down to the nitty gritty. So, you press this button right here. All right, you can see your different options. Let's go to your settings, messages, audio, your trip info, fuel economy, driver assistance, and then performance. You can test your zero to 60. And then your off-road, your vehicle info, tire pressures, you can you got your speedometer. This is the steering wheel. As you can see, he has Alcantara right here. There was a carbon fiber, Alcantara right there. All this is Alcantara, by the way, all of it. This too right here, that right there, all right? Everything, Alcantara. Get the carbon fiber right here. And look in the back seats. Like, this is very, very roomy. Like the trucks back in the day didn't have this much room in the back seat, but like now you, it's extremely roomy. Even these have the carbon fibers. And every Ram has this significant piece right here, all right? It has the VIN number of the Ram that you're sitting in, all right? Shows you the horsepower, letting you know this is a 700 horsepower beast that you're sitting in. Another cool thing about this car is you can charge your phone wirelessly. Look, look at that. Boom, you guys can't really see what it's charging. I think that's also pretty cool. Carbon fiber right here, it's a cup holder, all right. He has stuff in here, so I won't be showing you guys what's in there, but this, this is pretty, this is pretty dope. This interior is a complete game changer when it comes to uh, trucks, all right? Because normally it's boring inside of a truck, but this isn't boring, all right? Now, if you want to see your different modes, all you gotta do is click this TRX button and boom, there you go. You got your sport, you got the tow, you got the snow, and you got the auto. I'll be showing you guys what this thing can do in sport. Notice when you click sport, it takes a traction control off, so this thing is ready to go. So when I do do a launch, it'll be in sport mode. So now we're in the back seat. Look at this. Come on, this is this is crazy. Most trucks have this, but this is crazy. I drive a Honda, so like, I'll never see that in my Honda. The AC seats right here, the heated seats right here. You wanna charge your phone, boom, there you go. All right, and like I said, this is all this whole thing right here is carbon fiber. And honestly, if you're if you're tall, all right, like you won't have an issue sitting back here because this, first off, there's a lot of room. All right, there's a lot of room, and it's it's high enough so where you won't be stuck. You get what I'm saying? You won't be stuck back here. You won't feel stuck at least. So back to the fun stuff. Yep, that is a camera. Your rear view mirror is literally a camera. Put this thing in reverse so I can show you guys the different cameras on the car. All the different cameras. Press this, it shows you from the rear, it shows you from the front. All right, you get the side. This is actually on top of the car. And then this is the back. This is a rear camera that you guys will be seeing in reverse. And then you just exit out. 
I think that's pretty cool. There's probably so much more that I'm probably missing about this truck because obviously I don't own it, but this truck is, it's insane. There's just so much more that you can do. Like just by looking at it, I know there's so much more you can do. But this is literally my favorite truck, my dream truck. Look, 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 look. We got Ram right there. Letting you know that this is a Ram that you're dealing with, all right? Got the, got the TRX on the seats. And then I'm gonna show you guys an interesting thing, all right? Ram took a big shot at the Raptor. I didn't even know this about the car until until Garrett showed me. So I'm gonna show you guys. We pop this cover off. What do you see here? That is a TRX demolishing a Raptor. <laughs> I find that pretty funny. Um, and boom, there goes the Hellcat motor. Look at that. Jeez, 6.2 guys. 6.2. Look at that. Now for the fun stuff. All right, so we'll be taking this bad boy on the road. We're gonna see what this thing can do. As you can see, it's already in uh, sport mode. All right, traction control is off. And uh, let's go. But this truck, this truck is very nice, man. Like, like driving this thing, I feel very high up. You know, it makes you feel superior when you're on the street. I guess that's how you feel when you're in most trucks but especially in this truck you're gonna feel superior because you I mean you got all that power behind you not only that this thing's 700 horsepower <laughs> like tell me a truck out there that's 700 horsepower besides this one i know you guys can hear that that supercharger is just loud it's letting you know it's there man that thing is crazy Another thing I like about this is the paddle shifters. They're nice and nice and compact. Oh man, easy little. Man, this thing is powerful. What's very sick right now is uh, I'm right next to another Ram. It's a Hemi, it's a 5.7 liter. It ain't got nothing on this. <laughs> it ain't got nothing on this. Man, that's crazy. But you can just see this thing is, it's very, look at that. It's literally a camera, guys. That's still absurd to me. But man, this thing is crazy. I found a straightaway, guys. Found the straightaway. But this truck is amazing so far, honestly. Um, it's everything that I that I thought it would be and more. But here we go. experience in this like I said this will probably be one of my favorite videos all right my favorite videos because this is literally my dream truck but I'm gonna show you guys uh, the launch control show you guys how to get engaged with that so you guys so you guys can see that for yourselves and then I'll be showing you guys some clips from outside of the car inside of the car you name it stay tuned all right guys so I'll be showing you guys how to do the launch control. You're basically gonna put your foot on the brake, all right? Press the launch control button. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh. Man. Oh, sh Oh, guys, this thing is this thing is a beast, literally a beast. I've never driven something this fast, and I'm gonna be honest, it controls extremely, extremely well with the amount of speed that you're gonna that you're gonna go with this car. So, like, I feel extremely safe. Honestly, I feel extremely safe 
and this is my first time driving uh, a truck like this and I feel completely safe I feel like I've, I've driven it before and I think that's like the best thing about about this truck or any truck that you that you buy because you know you don't want to drive a you don't want to get a truck and feel like okay I don't know I'm not safe I don't know what to do but this truck it's like it's like kind of like a video game you get it and you, you already know how to play you know what I'm saying that's kind of how it is but I'll show you guys some more clips Honestly, I'm, I'm speechless. Like, I'm, I'm very, very speechless. This car is by far the ultimate beast. I don't, I don't see a car out there touching this car. Um, well, truck, I should say, truck. Excuse me, guys, truck. I don't see a truck out there that is touching this truck. Honestly, man, screw it, car too. Because honestly, like, I could drive this in the rain. I won't worry about getting flooded. I won't worry about puddles. Nothing. This thing is. This thing is a beast, man. This thing is an ultimate beast. Shout out to my good friend Gary for letting me do a review on this car. This car, this car is amazing. Uh, it's literally gonna leave me speechless. If I have to do a rating on it, this car is going to get a 10 out of 10. And I'm, I'm a little biased, so I'm gonna do a 12 out of 10. But this car is definitely getting a 10 out of 10. It's crazy. It's um, the performance is, is ridiculous. It, it's it really it's really rough finding a car that has safety features and performance together. It's hard to find a car like that. This car has a lot of safety features. I couldn't even get into it, but it has that one safety feature that I noticed instantly. Like if you feel like you're drifting, it'll like it'll force you back over. It has that and I noticed that. I don't know, I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did through the video, all right? And if you do have a chance to, to drive one, man, take it on a straightaway and use that launch control because that launch control is something something else man honestly something else Let me go ahead and bless you guys <laughs> that supercharger is amazing too just listening to that supercharger all day oh my god i, I didn't want to drive my car every single day if i could but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed the video Ooh, nice brakes but i hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure you guys subscribe all right follow me on instagram that's one underscore more 97 and Listen, man, this is the best truck out there. Try to try to convince me otherwise in the comment section below. But this is the best truck out there. Other than that, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Make sure you guys have a fabulous day. All right? We are out.